Barber interception. McGarrett Blunt remains the back for Josh Freeman. Freeman looks, throws, that's a touchdown. Donald Penn on a tackle eligible play. The left tackle pulls in the touchdown. Not something you see very often in the NFL where you get a tackle eligible. Great job here on the play fake. Freeman does a great job. Just give him a nice touch ball and nice hands by the yeah. big guy. Being able to reach out and snag it out of the air. 6'5", 310 pounds. Look at him go down, soft hands. Looks like Charles Barkley there with a helmet on. Always love it when the big guys score the touchdowns because the whole team comes out and celebrates with them. Because uh, it doesn't happen very often. Buccaneers. That Mercer is the staff infection that impacted the Buccaneers locker room. Third and goal. So now Brian Leonard's the back. A fake to him. And a touchdown for Donald Penn. The tackle. <laughs> that just made Coach Chiano's night right there. They fake the power play off the right side. And Donald Penn in an unbalanced line secures the backside and leaks into the flat. And he is wide open. Two weeks in a row. The Buccaneers have used trickery on the goal line. Last week, Mike James threw a touchdown pass on a halfback pass at the one-yard line. How about Donald Penn, Mike? Second touchdown of his career. Third reception of his <laughs> career. He had one in 2010 at San Francisco. Carr throws low, but in the end zone, Matt McCants make that Donald Penn the extra lineman with a touchdown catch. Donald Penn starting left tackle for the Oakland Raiders and I said they were number one in the red zone. Well, if you got 290 or 300 pound offensive tackles catching balls, you know you've got some creativity down there. They've been using an extra lineman this entire drive. This is tackle eligible play. You see Donald Penn right there and I happen to play with Donald Penn in Tampa for a number of years. I think this might be his third or fourth touchdown of his career because he caught a couple. This is his third touchdown of his career because he caught a couple with me when I was in Tampa. It's actually a nice catch. He went down low to get that thing. Pullback. Play action. Carr on the move. Tosses it. And it's caught by Donald Penn, the former Buccaneer. Fake to Martin. Then a dump. And it is juggled and caught by Jumbo Fake the down block and Boomer Esiason to find him in the end zone a lot. Wild pass off in the corner of the end zone. There's a touchdown. It was first and goal. We had to score to take it in overtime, and I was basically the primary receiver, so it was either catch the football or walk home from Cleveland. Boomer throws into the end zone to Anthony Munoz. Touchdown. 20 yards in third down situations on this drive. And Brady, he's got Nate Solder his tackle. down last week and they give it to him again they don't and then Trubisky throws and that's caught by Bradley Soul lineman eligible for the touchdown penalty gives the Bengals great field position Domitop Penko lead blocker instead the pass out here to the tackle eligible on Andrew Whitworth for the touchdown nicely done by the Cincinnati Bengals who get on the board first Well, you work all week on trying to identify who the eligible receivers are. Whitworth is lined up, lined up at the right tight end. Lamar Woodley is lined up on him, but then Woodley comes off 56 there to rush Palmer. And, you know, Lamar Woodley goes, man, I just, who would have thunk it? And in motion is Andre Johnson. Mariota play action goes underneath. It's caught. This is Taylor Luan. Surprise, surprise, and look at the big fella. And they're going to fake it. Ryan going to float it for the touchdown. Seattle back in it. Oh, it's a fake. Direct snap, Boswell throws, and it is caught by Villanueva for a touchdown. Two in place of Carl Banks for the Giants. Third and goal at the one-yard line. And a play fake. Rosenbaugh throws to Sharp for the touchdown. 
Now that's why they got in trouble when Louis Sharp went in the last time and didn't report. You see a 67 on the end of the line and defensively you ignore him. But on that kind of situation, you've got to report to the officials so the official can tell the defense, 67, eligible receiver. Watch number 67, the end of the line. Nobody worried about Lewis Sharp. He's a great athlete. And in this situation, a great wide receiver. <laughs> Bring in another extra offensive lineman. And look at this. It is a touchdown to Taylor Decker, who is eligible. Push remains second down and goal. The fake. Touchdown, Khalif Barnes. The tackle eligible. The Raiders have tied the game. Give credit to Hugh Jackson understanding the talents of his football players and the talent on his team. We talk about versatility. Khalif Barnes, you mentioned it at the top of the game. There he is. He's a tight end. An offensive lineman play a tight end. He releases the ball in the belly of the big man for a touchdown. Roll, let it roll. Play clock rolling again, third and goal. Play fake and then wide, wide open. Anthony Costanzo on a tackle eligible. <laughs> we go right out here like this. Tackle eligible. There is no eligible receiver on the line of scrimmage. And watch this dance. This may be the best one I've ever seen. A little shot on Vince Wilfork. Oh, you know he's been thinking about that for a long time. <laughs> That's awesome. From the wall. It's a we started it last year against the Raiders. Joe Valerio with his first ever NFL score. It was kind of a, a deceptive play last year. Uh, this year it's become kind of a, a thing that I've learned to do. He catches pretty well for a lineman. He, he has pretty good hands. Touchdown Valerio. The wide open Joe Valerio. The tackle eligible touchdown. He didn't have the time to call the whole game. Yeah, Shows you can be done. Yeah, no blitzes either. No one got mad enough and went on their own. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go, boys. This could be good. <laughs> and still on his feet is Owens going to pitch it to the center, Alex Mack. <laughs> he he is is a score. He snuck it. He He won't get there. Oh <laughs> Alex Mack from the Cleveland Browns. Now, say that, that, that. That's good right there. I like that. That's fun. Now we see why I use the time. There you go. We stand corrected. How about that? Now see that that is something that young man Alex Max is going to remember. Yeah, that ball's no going down his trophy ever. case. No doubt Forever. about it. And good for him. Or good on you, mate, as they say, you know. Good for him indeed. And now he's got to go back and snap the point after. I hope he's in shape. <laughs> he's been off the This ball's going to launch over the holder's head. You watch. He's winded.